Israeli corporation Rafael Advanced Defense Systems has unveiled a new precision missile. Called Seabreaker, the missile is a naval and artillery unit force multiplier designed to overcome the challenges of the modern warfare arena, Rafael said in a statement. It can be used for various purposes, including sea to sea, sea land, land sea or land land missions against high value targets. The missile is touted to be fifth generation weapon and has features that enable it to work in environments where other missiles could fail. Viewers may note that Rafael Advanced Defense Systems is considered one of Israel's premier military corporations and is responsible for developing some of the world's leading weapon systems, including the Iron Dome air defense system and the Precision Guided Spike Missile. In this video, Defense Updates analyzes why Israeli Seabreaker missile could be a super effective weapon. Let's get started. This video is sponsored by War Thunder. If you are, like us, fascinated by military vehicles and technology, I recommend you give War Thunder a try. It's a military vehicle combat game which you can download and play for free on PC, PlayStation 4 and Xbox One with cross-platform support. It has a huge variety of more than 1,200 playable aircraft, tanks, helicopters and ships from the 1930s to the 1990s which you can take to battle on land, in the air and at sea on more than 80 theaters of war. War Thunder has been kind enough to offer All Defense Updates viewers a special bonus which will grant you a free premium tank, aircraft or ship and three days of premium account time for registering using our link in the description below. So take the plunge and join more than 20 million players from around the world. Seabreaker is a 4 meter long missile, weighs a bit less than 400 kilograms or 881 pounds. It flies at high subsonic speeds towards its target. Seabreaker can hit targets at a distance of up to 300 kilometers or around 186 miles. According to the company, the battery architecture supports standalone launchers or operates as an integrated solution with a command and control unit CCU, and various sensors. The missile can be launched from naval platforms of varying size from fast attack missile ships to corvettes and frigates. Based on Rafael's Spider launchers, the Seabreaker can also be fired from vehicles such as Humvees, making it flexible and mobile. Unlike some other missiles designed by the corporation, it's not meant to be launched from submarines or aircraft. Senior Rafael officials told reporters it's smart and to the point. It was added that the Seabreaker brings all the capabilities of the Israeli company into one precision strike fifth generation missile. According to senior Rafael officials, the company took the capabilities of both the Spike and LOS and SPICE missiles and combined them to make the Seabreaker. It has infrared homing and automatic target recognition capabilities. It can be launched both during the day or night and in all weather conditions. The missile has an advanced IIR imaging infrared seeker with which it can engage both maritime and land targets in advanced anti-access or area denial arenas. It can hit targets in littoral or brown water including archipelagos and also strike targets where previous Generation RF seeker based missiles are not effective, Rafael said. The Seabreaker can maneuver and dodge obstacles while it flies at terrain following low level flight above the ground or sea skimming. This makes the missile very hard to detect with air defense radar. With data sharing and man in the loop systems, the operator can see exactly when the missile hits its target even when launched from a standalone range. Seabreaker carries a sophisticated warhead. In a statement, Rafael said, flying at high subsonic speeds, Seabreaker has a multi-directional, synchronized, full-sphere attack capability, 
based on predefined attack plans, according to waypoints, azimuth, impact angle, and aim point selection, ensuring a high probability of mission success with a 250 pound 113 kilograms penetration, blast, and fragmentation warhead, making a single hit effective enough to neutralize a frigate sized ship. The precision strike missile can be operated in GPS denied areas. The Seabreaker can fulfill operational missions without GPS, as it has state of the art electro optical seekers with unique scene matching algorithms, navigation guidance, and homing techniques. As per reports, the missiles use artificial intelligence and other advanced technologies like deep learning and big data based scene matching to automatically acquire and track targets. The missile allows the operator to make decisions and tactical updates. The Seabreaker also has a mid-flight abort capability and battle damage assessment for operators. Seabreaker is immune to electronic countermeasures ECM, and is jam resilient. It's mission effective, said the official, adding that it can strike targets when you want, how you want, and from where you want. Rafael CEO General Yoav Har Even stated, The performance trials, together with a broad range of Rafael's technological capabilities, allows us to today present the Seabreaker missile with advanced multi service use, which provides a solution to diverse long range threats in a complicated and crowded arena. The missile has innovative aerodynamic architecture that makes it light and compact meaning it can be installed on small naval platforms such as missile boats while significantly enhancing their capabilities. The head of Rafael's Land and Naval Systems Division, Ran Ghazali, said in a statement, All of these capabilities put together enable the missile system to deal with emerging threats and challenges in the next generation battlefield. According to Raphael, Seabreaker was developed to address an operational gap in maritime dominance and deep land strike systems through a single platform. On paper, Seabreaker seems to be well designed to fulfill this. Importantly, Israeli weapons do perform well in real battle scenarios, unlike the weapons of many other countries which have been found to be wanting. Prima facie, there's no reason to doubt the capabilities of the missile, though a real-world use case will certainly add to confidence. Enemies of Israel have a lot to worry about when it comes to Seabreaker.